Alright, so we're done with the vault, and we're going to be going north. And that was a random encounter. And if I sound different here today, uh, then I usually do sorry. I have actually haven't recorded uh, for about a week or so before this, because uh, I've had this annoying sore throat type thing. It's not that bad, but it did make recording rather uh, less than desirable. Anyway, this is West Olympa Cave, and you may be noticing that there's this gate here that just went and smashed down, so we can't go through there. Um, it wasn't high enough to let us through even when it was up, uh, and you can't send it back up anyway for some reason. Uh, if you come in here, this is Lumpa. You want to enter Lumpa? Sure, why not? I said the exact opposite of what I said on the screen, didn't I? No, I'm totally not here to save Hammett. The Dampa, well, the Dampa can go put a sock in it. Alright. So, we are clearly not... I got the level up, but as I was saying, we are clearly not welcome uh, in that uh, Lumpa place. And if I could get more than like four few without running into something wild, that would be awesome. I don't know if walking will make a difference, it doesn't Pokemon, but like seriously. It's like riding your bicycle through the tall grass with a Pokemon with Illuminate at the front of your party and... Ugh. Anyway, uh, you may notice here if you zoom out a little, there's more that you can uh, see around the overworld. To explore but there's nothing really of interest there that I've ever found or that anybody has ever pointed out to me so I'm not gonna worry myself with that I don't really want to waste any more time getting to the random encounters um, my synergy is getting kind of low well, it's coming back it was kind of low because I was just uh, using it to deal with the uh, enemies and that probably I like how the sound of the waterfall goes out when you push the block and um, yeah that were that was depe depleting my PP kind of quickly. Anyway, uh, let's see. What can I be doing here? I believe I have a move on the, uh, the L button, so I can just do that. And I can't drop down, and that's basically just dead space. And I can come up here. And I can come over here. Can I please please? No, no, it doesn't look like it. Uh, there's... It would appear that there's a vine, uh... Covering that stuff, and I can't really do anything with that. Uh, where am I supposed to be going? I thought I could drop down there, but apparently not. Alright, so as you can tell, I'm, uh, extremely on top of my game here. Let's see... Hate it when I sneeze while I'm recording. Um, let's see, there's this thing there. Uh, I guess I might as well go and talk about that. And... Let's see, come back up here. This thing, if you try and use a synergy on it, it's kind of stuck, your hand just bounces off it. And yeah, there's that. I, uh... Took a minute to remember that. And, uh, yeah, if you try to use Synergy on it, you're gonna activate cutscene. Hello, uh, what's your face? Ivan, that's it. Yeah, I, I, I knew that. I totally knew that. I didn't have to think about it for, like, five minutes before I remembered your name. I know. I have a great idea. Leave it to me. Alright, let's see this great idea. Warwind! Alright! That looks so... GBA-ishly awesome and stuff. And, well, uh, the leaves are gone. And it looks like we can probably use a synergy on that now. Uh-huh. Hmm, you couldn't get into Lumpa, neither could we. The knuckleheads at the gate weren't very friendly today, were they? Oh, really? Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm sure Garrett's still really happy about that, right? I can't rescue Master Hammett. I want to help you. Alright. Fair enough. Please, allow me to join your quest. I mean, three, uh, three playable characters in a turn-based RPG is better than two, isn't it? So, yeah, we're gonna be going to Bin Blin. To this day, that word, it, it's only like seven letters long, but it drives me absolutely crazy. I have no idea if it's like Bin Blim or Blin Bin or... It's... it looks ridiculous. But, in any case, we're gonna push that off now. And, uh, we're gonna do that. And that's fallen into the waterfall, and it looks like there's something down there now. Uh, yeah. Don't question me about Blin... whatever the place that we're going next is. Uh, I've never been good at reading stuff and seeing what it is. Not like... Eh, what am I doing? Not like dyslexic or anything, but... Uh... 
I don't know. It took me like five years to figure that Expelliarmus is pronounced Expelliarmus and not a number of other uh, ridiculous pronunciations. Let's see. Synergy. Isaac. Whirlwind. Let's use it on this Ivy here. Why I went down there, I have no idea. I was talking about uh, pronouncing Expelliarmus instead of Golden Sun. Let's see. I am almost restored on a uh, PP right now. And that's probably a good thing because you have random encounters in here and that's not fun. Uh, let's see. This is the Goma Cave. Or something like that. The Goma crossover, I don't know. It's got something to do with Goma, and I know that because that's where we're going. Alright, so let's see, there is probably something down here. Can I jump across there? Thanks. And let's see, what's down these steps? Hopefully something useful, although, I don't know. I say useful, but I don't want to especially go where I'm supposed to to progress with the story until I have to. Find as many, uh, items and stuff as possible. But let's see, we can uh, use move on this, push that that way, jump over here, and we can use move on that again, push that that way, over here, treasure chest, please be something good. That is a lucky metal, alright, I have no idea what the lucky metal is for, but I think it's just basically the, uh, like the nugget and stuff of Golden Sun. Um, yeah, I, let's see, I got distracted, I, I've been recording for about 10 minutes here, and uh, my recording file is at over 700 megabytes already, so how was I doing? I should probably find a better uh, video codec to be recording this with. Let's see, we're going to push that down there, and that's going to fall into the pit, and we don't see what happens to that now, but uh, presumably we're going to find it later at the bottom. Yeah, so I'd probably either find a better uh, recording codec or find a better recording codec. And Isaac got a level up, so a couple of stats going up. I haven't got a level up as well, so that's really nice. Uh, yeah, I'm... Uh, where did I just come from? Let's see, uh, can I go here? Yes, I can go here. I'm still kind of getting used to this capture card that I have, and for some reason or another, it doesn't seem to see support the... Uh... I think I'm going to go back down here. The, the same um, record uh, video codec as my... Oh my god, I keep getting interrupted, uh, but, yeah. Still, uh, getting used to all that. Alright, so, with all these random encounters, I'd better be, like, level 500 by the end of the game. Anyway, um, I believe, but I'm not sure, that, and that was Isaac getting a level up, uh, I think, or it might have been Garrett. But I believe, but I'm not sure, that there's something over here. Yeah. I hope you all were watching this playthrough for like my simply amazing commentary rather than this for being an actual helpful walkthrough. But if you come over here and push this over here, uh, this will be clearing a path from where we were up there to over here where that, uh, that gin is. And we'll be able to go and uh, fight it, so let's see. And thank god for video editing, making it look like I just warped right from that random encounter over here. But, this is a Jin. I'm not sure if this is going to fight us before we, uh... Before we add it to our party. I wish Pokemon were like that. I wish sometimes you could just, like, go up to a Pokemon and you could add it to your team without having to fight it and catch it and stuff. Actually, you can kind of do that when NPCs give you, like, your starters and, uh... Gift EVs and whatnot. Anyway! You there! Whoa! Alright, so you are going to fight us. Uh, this guy's name is, if I recall correctly, I don't recall correctly, I don't know what it is. Totally not going on IGN right here, but, uh, that's Forge. But this guy is the, uh, Mars-type gen, fire-type, in other words. Uh, that would imply ground is super effective on you, probably, if I, if I know my type effectiveness. Um, I'm just gonna go and attack you regular, and I'll just stun you with some thunderbolts and hope for the best. Uh, you took 38 damage, Flint... I didn't see how much damage that did. Uh, I... It looks like I should be healing up a little bit here. Let's see, I have Cure. I'll be using that on me because I have the least HP. Uh, Garrett. Uh, Mr. Thunderbolt. By the way, I meant to talk about Ivan in battle. Ivan's in battle properties one of these days. Uh, Ivan's fast and has a lot of uh, PP, but not all that much like HP and defense and stuff. Uh, so... 
he's probably going to... Yeah, sorry. So he's probably going to be going first a lot in battle. Um, so you can plan your strategies accordingly around that. Uh, let's see, Quake, because why not? Uh, I hit the wrong button, didn't I? Uh, what else to say? Come on, don't... Alright, so you're not doing that much damage to me. Uh, you are going to be saying something to me, it looks like. Why... I hate that noise. But... Uh, I forgot his name already. Forge is during the party. That guy down there is telling us that we can go and uh, find Jin around the overworld. And I think... Wrong button. I think I should probably uh, set you to me. You also. But that was, yeah, our first Jin that we found around the overworld that wasn't like a scripted part of the game. So there's that. Uh, we can move on now. Let's see, what was I... And someone's a Windseer. Who would that be? That would be the, uh, the Jupiter guy that... What's his face? Uh, Ivan. I am really low in HP. That is not something that I want to be uh, walking around with. So fortunately, I have these fancy things. That only restored half. Bang. Gara has like twice as much HP as uh, Ivan. Not quite that much, but still. Anyway, so it looks like I missed something else, but I don't know what it was. Probably because I was talking and not... And Isaac got a level up. So we've had a lot of level ups in uh, this recent... Uh, session of recording. Alright, so I was saying... And as per usual, I was forgetting that we have that crazy tool. Alright, so that's gonna fall down there and it's going to, uh... It's going to create us a lovely little passage uh, from one side of the river to the other. So, right here, real quick, we could just jump back to the beginning of Goma Cave and we'd be, uh, basically outside. So we just created ourselves a nice shortcut. And we can come over this way, and I believe uh, we're getting close to the exit, so let's just follow the river. Ooh, cool, a bridge. And we can come down here, out here, and we're back on the world map, alright.